Now you guys go so many different places, right. so is there a specific restaurant that you look forward to going to or a certain kind of food you're just really craving? You know, I don't know if there's a specific restaurant, but it's funny, a lot of times coaches are creatures of habits in many ways. And so, you know, you've done, at least in my case, this will be 24 years. So when you've done it that long, you sort of settle into routines and you have certain restaurants that you're mm -hmm. familiar with. Uh, probably the worst thing that happens is when you go someplace, you're looking forward to a meal, you get to the restaurant and the restaurant's closed down now. So, so that, that <laughs> right, those, those are the things that get you. But, you know, I enjoy going to Papa Do's and places like that and just being able to, you know, relax. And most of the coaches are typically at the same places, so being able to fellowship also. Now, what about hotels? Would you say you're more Marriott, um, uh, listen, Hilton? Listen, listen, <laughs> I am a Marriott guy all the way. Uh, let's see, 24 years in, I'm a Lifetime Platinum member. Okay. So I didn't know that even existed. So you're loyal. Very loyal. So I don't I don't have to do, I think it's 75 nights a year to get to Platinum. So I don't have to do that anymore. I automatically get Platinum status. So that means that I've spent a lot of nights away, uh, too many nights away <laughs> in someone else's bed. But it's, it's been good. So I enjoy the perks. So in your 24 years, is that what you said? Yes. So 24 years, what has been the most memorable thing that's come out of going to these different summer uh, circuits? Well, I think it's probably, you know, watching some of the players uh, and, and watching, you know, how they go on in their careers and, you know, going back to when I first got into it and started and, and remembering, you know, going to watch uh, Kevin Garnett play. And it's funny because certain guys stick out in your mind, but um, he was a kid that was from South Carolina at the time. Um, I was at the University of South Carolina and he is just joy and excitement to play. So you felt like when you went out there that you were gonna see something possibly unique and different. And then of course, he goes straight into the NBA. And the very next year there in Columbia, we have Jermaine O'Neal. So that's his senior year in high school. So to be able to watch both of those at that time kids play, and I knew they were special. Um, and then of course, you know, hey, they go into the NBA and have great careers. So, uh, that was a good time to be able to see that, you know, and be young in the coaching game. 